everybody, BrickLover18 here today, and I'm going to show you how to build the impossible Lego triangle that truly is impossible to build because it's just an optical illusion. So this is what the Lego triangle actually looks like when it's not being used in an optical illusion. To make the first part of the contraption, what you're going to need to do is take your 2x6 plate as well as your 2x6 brick and stack them on top of each other, leaving two studs on each side. Next, you're going to take your 2x2 brick, put it here, and your 2x2 plate, and put it here. Set that off to the side and gather five 2x2 bricks and just stack them on top of each other. Set that off to the side as well, and gather the rest of the parts you need to make the base. First, you're going to need the 2x6 plate up top here, and just put it to the very end, as well as take the 2x2 plate here. On the bottom, you're going to need to take your 1x2x4, sorry, as well as your 2x6, doesn't really matter what order, and set it there like that. You're going to need to get your 1x5 brick that you already made, set it like that, as well as the 2x8 brick and plates you also made. Now, when you position this in the right angle, you'll see the optical illusion. Now that you know how to build the triangle and you realize it's not that hard, it's time to create your photography setup so you can capture the best picture and make this look as real as possible. So the first thing is definitely just placing your camera. It takes a lot of moving the tripod around, choosing camera angles, moving the camera up and down, just to find a good overall angle. When the camera's too low, you can see that it's a fake and not actually real, but the, when the camera's too high, you can see that the parts don't line up. So it's just a lot of experimenting to make sure your camera is in line perfectly. The next thing is your lights. You have to make sure your lights are in a good position, and again, the higher the better, because when they're too low, you can see the different light shadows on the Lego pieces, and you can see that the top is lighter than the dark, or the dark is lighter than the top, and vice versa. So when I have my lights positioned right directly over the setup, it really makes the colors look the same, therefore completing the optical illusion. The whole time, you're also just really going to need to position the little Lego build just any way you want. It's really hard to do, and again, there's no set, you know, have it at this angle, have your camera at this height. It's just a lot of experimenting, and eventually, after half an hour, like me, you'll find the perfect way to make this optical illusion look absolutely amazing. Thanks everybody so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to check out the official photo I have posted of the triangle on Instagram. It, I really appreciate it. I'm really sorry I don't know the origin of this like little optical illusion. So I apologize for that. But I really do hope you enjoyed the video. And let me know down below if you want to see more videos like this.